and guys, it is actually here. Welcome back to another Wars video. Today I'm going to be giving my preview uh, on tomorrow's night's game between Birmingham at Wolves uh, at St Andrews. Uh, it's a Monday night kickoff. Uh, it's, it's a little bit weird um, being on a Monday night, but uh, if we get to the Premier League this season, uh, it might be something we have to get used to and maybe play in a couple of uh, Monday night football. Um, Monday night football games um, next season uh, for Sky Sports, but uh, who knows? But anyway, anyway, we're getting sidetracked. It's a massive game, and I'm, 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 I'm like the Bolton game. I'm, I'm flowing with confidence coming into this game. Uh, we we've, we've come back off a fantastic November, which would would be non-existent for like the season before. Um, as before this November just gone, we we won zero, literally zero games in November, and we've just come back off off uh, off uh, four wins in November, four out of four wins in November. It's just absolutely perfect. So uh, yeah, I I'm coming with every inch of confidence uh, coming into this uh, game at St Andrews tomorrow night. Uh, it's under the it's under the sky cameras, and I, I'm 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 with every confidence that we're going to pick up a victory. And um, Birmingham still struggling, um, still struggling down there in the bottom three of the championship, while we uh, sit uh, top of the championship only by one point, as uh, as I do believe Cardiff d did win yesterday. So our uh, four point lead. It's cut down to one, so if we do win, but if we do win, it will go back to four points. But obviously, if we if we draw, it will only be it'll uh, be halved. Our our lead that we had before uh, of four points cut down to cut down to one by Cardiff, and then um, our four point lead that uh, we used to have was cut by half. Or will be cut by half to two points if we only manage to draw at St Andrews, which I don't think is going to happen. Um, Nevers is, I think, is suspended, which um, is a little bit of a blow, um, but I don't think it should affect us that much, really, um, because uh, we've still got the likes of uh, Jota, Bonacini. Uh, all of them still still got uh, Cavalero. Uh, we still got our front line available. Uh, all all of our front line available, which is good. So uh, so our attack is still going to be as strong as it always is. But just that uh, one one um, what one man in midfield is uh, going to be absent for the game since obviously he's suspended as he's got too many yellow cards after picking up that yellow card. Uh, in the game against Bolton uh, last Saturday, uh, but as I said already, I'm coming with lo loads of confidence coming into this game, and I think I think we're at, with the team we've got. With the team we've got, I, I just think it's going to be too much. It's going to be too much for Birmingham. They're, they're going to try. Yes, they're, they're going to try and be 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 like the uh, the Cardiff team. And and other teams that have been physical against us, they're trying to. They're gonna probably try and uh, be a bit physical and try and uh, lunge into some challenges. But yeah, it, they're they're probably gonna uh, try to stop us from playing our usual passing game, um, like um, other teams have done so far this season. And um, uh, I think. Uh, only Cardiff have been successful uh, of doing that, being physical and stopping us playing from our passing game. Um, so I think that I, th I think that that passing game. Um, I think Birmingham are trying to g trying to break, going to try and break it up, uh, but I don't think it, it's um, it's going to work in the end um, because. Since that Cardiff game early on in the season, I think I think uh, Nuno has has uh, taught them how to be like resilient to that kind of play that some teams in the Championship may try to play against us. So um, I think I think we're still 
we're just going to be resilient uh, against that and uh, we're, we're going to come through um, and uh, I'm really hopeful. I'm just going to put it out there, 3-0 win um, and uh, another three points in the bag. Um, and uh, I, I must say, our goal difference, uh, looking at our goal difference, it's absolutely insane. Um, plus 23 goal difference already. We're, we're, on, we're, we're coming to the end of 2017. Um, now, this season, but still, we're only a couple of months into the season, uh, we're only about, uh, four months into the season, and we've already got that good of a goal difference, for the past, compare, if you compare that to the past few seasons, that is, it, it's, it's really, really impressive, um, so, uh, yeah, 3-0 win against Birmingham, come on, let's do this, Three points in the bag, another three points in the bag, and that'll be our. I think our, that'll be our thirteenth win of the season. I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, because um, I, I looked at the table last night. Uh, obviously, I know Cardiff are one point behind us, but um, yeah, um, with a wit, hopefully we can extend that to four points. And uh, I'm really confident we can do that as well. So uh, yeah. Um, I'm I'm so so excited for this game and uh yeah I can't I can't wait to uh can't wait to fresh blues uh tomorrow night. It's it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be fun. Um Imagine if we score a scream or something like that 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 would be quite good. <laughs> that would be quite cool if I, uh if we can maybe score a scream or something, I don't know. Um that'd be quite cool in the in a derby. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm coming with every confidence, and, uh, yeah, 3-0 win, let's go and get the three points, and, uh, hope, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna, uh, come back with a positive review on Tuesday, uh, until then, goodbye guys!